Thank you so much for tuning in today. My name is Julie Olivares, and have you ever thought about using a highlighter but you're not quite sure what to do with it or if you would even like it? Well, if so, stay tuned because I'm going to show you today how you can actually use eyeshadow as a highlighter. This also, of course, works great if you're in a pinch, uh, maybe you're traveling, you only brought a few makeup items with you. It's a great way to kind of multi-use a product, so I really like that about it. So uh, what I'm going to show you today is how to highlight up here for your brow area and how to highlight the cheekbone area. Um, as you can see, they've got a little bit of a uh, shimmer going on here, and that's exactly where you're going to be putting these products. So today uh, I'm going to be using these two colors. This is a nice shimmery um, like ivory color, and this one here is a nice um, shimmery champagne color. So what I'm going to do for the brow, so I've got nothing um, up here, it's just my natural skin color. I'm going to take just a little bit of that light color, you don't need a whole lot, tap off any excess, and I'm just going to gently apply this right up along the brow. Then what you can do once you get the desired kind of shimmer that you want, you can go ahead and pull that down with your brush to meet your other color, um, which this one here is um, called Lively, this really pretty apricot color. And what I'm gonna do is just blend that together nicely. Then if you feel like you need a little bit more, um, certainly grab a blending brush, feel free to blend that. So that just works really nice as a nice way to highlight that brow area. Then if you wanna highlight your cheekbone, what you wanna focus on with highlighting the cheekbone is more so highlighting the top of the cheekbone as opposed to the front. Now certainly you're gonna get some on the front, but let that just be kind of what falls and settles there. Focus on really the top of the cheekbone the other thing when you're putting a highlighter on your cheekbone is really only bring it over to about the center of your eye to right about here. You don't want to bring it in too close to your nose. It will really throw off the dimension of your face. Um, so just something to know. So keep it out here. What I'm going to use today is a fan brush. Now this is ideal for this type of an application. However, if you don't have it, any sort of smaller, thin, fluffy brush is going to work. And that's why a fan brush is ideal because you are trying to apply this shimmer color in such a specific area that you want something that's thin. So as you can see, I mean, it's not even as wide as my pinky finger. Um, and then it, the bristles move very, very easily. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this fan brush and I'm going to run it through that champagne color. Tap off any excess and I'm going to start right there about the middle of my eye and just move it back and forth. And you can see right there, boom, got the highlight color applied. So um, just really quick and easy ways to do it. Of course, um, you know, you can choose any colors you want, you know, especially uh, for something really fun. Uh, maybe if you're going to a really fun party or costume or anything, you know, play around with different colors, purples and blues and uh, greens or anything fun that you want to put on your cheeks. Um, soft pinks are really pretty, but I do recommend when you are using a highlight color on your cheeks, you want something with a little bit of a shimmer to make that pop. So if you've got questions, of course, please feel free to let me know. I'm here to help you, uh, here to help you uh, and answer any questions that I can. You can always check out my blog on my website, which is julieoliverius.com. And if you've got questions, let me know. I'll chat with you later. Bye.